India has suspended funding for Bangladesh railway projects valued at around 5,000 crore rupees. The Himachal Pradesh government has urged the Centre for Raising Himachal Scouts Battalion, like Sikkim Scouts and Ladakh Scouts. Indian Army conducted 3D printing and FPV drone development course, under which the participants successfully built and operated a fully functional FPV drone. Hindustan Aeronautics has embarked on an ambitious initiative to develop an aerospace-grade 3D printer, that will significantly reduce the time required to manufacture high-performance parts for aircraft. Talks with Indonesia have reached an advanced stage for the purchase of Brahmo's supersonic cruise missiles worth $450 million. The Brahmo's missile deal with Vietnam will be sealed in a few months and the deal is valued at approximately $700 million. An Indian Air Force contingent has arrived at Al Dafra Air Base in UAE to participate in the Desert Flag 10 multinational air exercise. In a major development, the talks for the development of a sixth-generation jet engine for the AMCA program have concluded, and India will sign the landmark agreement by July. Industry sources indicate that Rolls-Royce is the selected partner, largely due to its experience with sixth-generation jet engine technology through the UK-led Tempest program, and due to its co-development offer with complete intellectual property rights transfer and export rights as well as establishing production facilities in India and assisting with engine testing. The program will cost $5 billion, that will fund engine development, local production lines, prototype creation, and extensive ground and in-flight testing. The sixth-generation jet engine will incorporate variable cycle technology for superior fuel efficiency and thermal management, that will also lay the foundation for sixth-generation aircraft. The deal is closely monitored by the Prime Minister's office, that encompasses a detailed roadmap for development program costs workshare technology transfer and intellectual property rights. Bharat Earth Movers Limited has initiated a formal process to co-develop a wheeled armoured fighting vehicle and an anti-tank guided missile system with at least 50% indigenous content. The plan is to collaborate with a global technology partner to develop a modern 8x8 armored platform integrated with fire and forget ATGMs, that will have amphibious capability, Stanag level 3 protection, crewless turret with 30mm cannon, advanced thermal sights and laser detection, and CBR and protection and power backup systems. Today's top 3 comments.